Hi, I'm Jale. Welcome to my channel. This is going to be a reading for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, 15th up to it, including the 31st of March 2021. If you have these placements in Gemini, any placements in Gemini, this reading could be for you. Remember, this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. If you feel like this is not your kind of reading, that's fine. Just, you know, check other aspects of your chart. Could well be that they resonate for you more. Let's have a look at Gemini's theme now for 15th up to and including the 31st of March 2021. What's the theme for Gemini? Theme. Oh, the star bottom of the deck is the fall new start healing future new start healing taking a leap of faith for some healing some kind of hope prospects bottom of the deck is strength someone could be building up the strength to leave a situation that i'm hearing is feeling hopeless let's take a look um we're going to use the show me a specific deck yeah we're going to use these this deck and um, before we jump into that we're going to use the amenti oracle just to get an idea of what else spirit want to say here for gemini's please spirit, what is it you would like to share for the gemini readings please using the There's something about focusing on details, um, but it's a minute focusing on in on details. Either someone's doing that or someone needs to. That's going to be really specific for someone there. I've also got Virgo energy here. I embrace the all. So that there's something about this that is about um, accepting a reality, accepting what is, moving past what is to then embrace a healing element. I respect the prosperity of others. There needs, it looks like there might need to be a bit of forgiveness here of some sort. But let's take a look. Let's jump into the tarot. But this is about embracing. There's something about this that someone has to come to terms with here in order to move forward. All right. So let's take a look. 35. Knight of Pentacles came out. So this is about rebuilding something here. Let's take a look. Yeah, we've got the Queen of Swords, bottom of the deck, Five of Swords. So there's been some arguments here, I feel. Um, I'm hearing discussion about what's to come, okay? So there could have been a bit of a fallout. Um, maybe the early part of the month, there was a bit of a fallout around this situation and i'm hearing repairing the damage so someone it's like either we go into a new cycle to repair the damage or we break away to actually fix what we need to but there's been some damage here there's been something here that's been developing could be a love situation um yep there's a weight there was a weight that's ended something was put on hold and has now ended um there could have been a long, long, long pause or long dragging out of a situation or something that people couldn't quite work out what to do. Or there could have been a situation where someone wasn't really looking at what to do and then it crept up on them and now the situation has been resolved. But there's been some kind of ending here or some kind of pause in action or again, a closure of a cycle to begin anew. But whatever it is, it's a definitive close, period, point blank, full stop. An ending to a new beginning. Um, let's see. But there's definitely been some kind of um, pause that has ended. So it could have been there was an argument, a pause to decide what to do. And now this part of the of the tail end of the month is where people are deciding, do we, do we split or do we twist? Do we, do we try this again? Do we leave? Um, what is the, the right thing to do here? Because the fall talks about a new beginning um, and the star is about hope and prospects. So new beginning here or new beginning elsewhere. Four of cups. So it looks like there's a rejection here, three of swords. So there's a definitive closure. Something has absolutely ended here. Closed off, finished. Someone has embraced an ending. 
And so now there's a review of do we go our separate ways and look to the future for some hope or do we do we wait until we look to the future and then go our separate ways or do we try this again and there's there's some healing that we can do let's have, have a look to see, oh we've got cards going everywhere eight of pentacles someone looks like yeah someone's finished working on whatever this is they don't want to work on it there is that they're not putting that someone is not prepared to put any more time effort energy into this situation because they're saying lost cause i'm hearing lost cause someone has viewed this now as a lost cause yeah uh, i keep hearing they were they felt expendable or someone made them believe they were expendable or something about that we've got extra pressure hard work um burdens responsibilities here that was just weighing too heavily that it was it was the the grounded element someone was expecting too much way too much and there's an emotional removal someone's emotionally moved away whatever this is about it feels like a, a partnership here where a masculine could have moved away from a feminine who has, has been a little bit cold and is possibly looking to move towards someone else who isn't that way inclined or is more emotionally here i mean stable because there's a balance to it so that they're, they're looking for their security elsewhere someone has re realized that the security element in this is not what it is cracked up to be and there's there's a lost cause is what i'm i'm hearing okay um yeah this is now it's like this is not gonna there's a burden on having to bring this about now and not waiting so something could have been pushed forward so it could have been a long wait for this to happen and then suddenly everything happened very quickly possibly and unexpectedly maybe but there was possibly an opportunity but whatever it is it wasn't a great time but it was the right time divine timing but the masculine could be a little bit caught unaware because there's a little bit of healing that needs to happen here whatever's been going on there needs to be a little bit of healing um yeah king of swords the the, the masculine's done the masculine's absolutely not not entertaining this anymore um there's no there's nothing more to come from whatever that old situation was is this new cycle would be the new cycle of healing away from where i'm looking at, at the moment uh possibly with another person because this whatever this old relate yeah look death we've got an ending here um there's a loss there's been a big loss around the situation now if you're sat there going oh but i you know this hasn't happened to me either this is not your reading or the timing's a little bit off for you could be that this is about to sort of develop or that this has already happened for you all right but there's definitely been a significant loss there's also something about a missed opportunity so something could be coming back around here is what i'm hearing okay so yeah the the, the chariot and the tower so someone has decided to step away from the situation and take the brunt of the responsibility for whatever that will bring it looks like it was a bit of a burden to leave a bit of an issue to leave uh a bit of a, a, clo a cold ending possibly yeah um they're not willing to put the effort they can't there's no more emotion that's left in this situation there's no more whatever's happened here was a very definitive closed draw line under the sand because <coughs> it feels very definitive is how i want to say it there's just a very definitive closure from what i'm looking at here it could have stemmed from someone else or an interest outside possibly which one party or both parties is trying not to acknowledge um but there definitely feels like there's a masculine that wants to move away from whatever energy they've been around that's probably felt a little bit cold into a more harmonious and balanced energy that I, again i'm just repeating what the guys are saying that they weren't getting in the situation and it reached a, a dramatic point or a dramatic head where do you know what also could have happened this masculine could have actually found an opportunity to start an argument to actually close this down all right because it feels like there was it this masculine was has been possibly dying to get out so there could have been you remember when i said about how this very quick movement there could have been a real quick succession of energy movement here from you know maybe you thought oh my goodness i can't believe this has happened this this is suddenly sped up um it the masculine's taken advantage of something here there's an opportunity that the masculine's seen all right 
Um, since that opportunity, I feel like the masculine is now going within to try and understand how to heal. Okay. And to decide what to do next. So there's decisions to be made in this situation. We've got the devil on the page of wands. So, mm, possibly this is not, this is why the fall is now, and there's a new cycle here. Because th this is not totally wrapped up. This is, the cycle's not totally, there's something that's ongoing in this. Yeah, look. So whatever this closed, whatever this started, whatever this ended, there's another stage to this that has to go through as well. That, um is not totally closed out that is possibly what is being discussed the tail end of this month so there's still ongoing discussions here could be finances could be you know commitments i think there is accusations that's being thrown around that because i think someone is going to be kind of know that the reason this closed out was possibly other influences um and that there were secrets and i think there could be some suggestion of that which is why there's accusations really um but it's brought about a closure to this hanging around there must have been a lot of waiting here because we've got the world and the hanged man here so there must have been things must have been really dragged out for some time and i feel like the masculine took advantage of that used the opportunity to end it but now I feel like there's definitely accusations flying around about why. Like, it could be that someone's realised that there's other people involved. Um, so one element of waiting has closed out. Which could have been that the leaving or there's one element that's closed. But there's another one that's still being left open. It could be that there's joint finances, there's children, there's something. Yeah, look. It could be a divorce. It could be um, something legal that needs to be looked into. But there's something that still is going to be tied here. That's again, we've got the fall and the star. So this is an open ended thing. It's like the re it looks like a relationship's over, but there's something at the end, tail end of that that has to be resolved. Legal issues, children, maybe property. Uh, yeah. So we've got someone who's now trying to work on getting a better footing into a deal or some kind of legal standing but interestingly there's a decision that has to be waited on so it looks like someone's got really frustrated with taking action with not taking action they've taken action and then they've realized oh well i can't move now anyway because the contract isn't up until i don't know february next year or oh, well, my lease is not up, or, oh, the legality of the document means that I can't do this until August. So it's like someone's acted on it and closed this out, but actually there's other elements that is now keeping them in a situation because there's a pause here. My guide's saying it's deliberate. It's not a, a, a random, it's not random. There's a deliberate pause. To understand could be to do with children could be to do with kids um so it could have been a very nasty breakup and now there has to be some th measures in place for the children which means they can't just suddenly move out and have done with it there has to be arrangements made for the children or something else um but there's definitely a waiting process here so it's not all cut and dried um but the masculine is it's like it's been done to make the masculine show someone you that they're serious about this all right so there's definitely a gesture here that's being made because it's their wish fulfillment. It's like they're scared of this, but they also know this is what they want, if that makes any sense. So they had, they felt they had to make a gesture. They could, they felt they couldn't act, but this was the best of whatever they could do. It, put it this way, it feels like someone's tried to make some kind of gesture so you understand, but there's still things tying this person in, like I, I mentioned. So, you know it feels like um a relationship that like that really okay so we're gonna pull some more cards here figure out what exactly else they have to say about the situation maybe what is being tied they're just saying timing the timing's not quite right someone's had enough of the situation now i'm gonna be honest with you if you're going yeah i told them to do this, this is... no 
no patience because I again there's a lot of there's a it's not quite ready yet um let's see what else we can figure out though for Gemini please we've got status so there's money tied up in this and defense so someone's trying to again a loss so they're trying to protect themselves we've got detachment and submission and again inheritance so it's like they had to make a move possibly so it could have been that someone's about to put money down on something and someone's had to make a quick move to close out a relationship but there's still legal money children something like that that's been sort of almost tying the situation in um is how i want to say it so it's not cut and dried excuse me right let's take a look what else is happening for this gemini reading spirit that we haven't already mentioned please what else there's a there was a big argument though fee flirt <gasps> sheds light on potential wealth within you it can never be stolen so it, again there's an, an element of finances here that someone's made a move on and this masculine looks like they've had to go nope and again it's closed the relationship but there's still an ongoing battle around the money or legal side of things or children something to do with that um so yeah it it doesn't look right let's take a look anything else you can tell us for gemini's reading that we haven't already looked at it was a control thing there's also something about a possible psychic this person could be intuitive maybe you're intuitive maybe you've warned them about this before but it's like there's a little bit more to go with this it's like they might think they're out the worst of it but there's a little it's i feel like the easiest part was to leave i feel like the it's it's now the next part that i feel is going to be an interesting well i say interesting it's not interesting at all is it it's a little bit intense but um let's get an idea for outcomes and then we'll pull some more cards like what can you tell us please for the outcome of gemini's reading what is the outcome for gemini's reading please yeah they've got choices they've got to make here they've got choices about and it's about finances that that's the choices we've also got here it's like they've made this really heroic move and they've walked straight into a trap that's how i want to say it it's like they've gone oh, i'm not taking this i'm going to make this move now and they've made a move but it's it's put them in a worse position i'm, I'm going to be honest with you because it, it could have just it could have riled up the situation more but we've got strength in the reverse and again it could be also have affected children all right and then we've got the tower and the king of wands with justice so it's like someone's made a bold move but it, it's it's not possibly done them a favor um i'm just i feel like it's created more trouble than it's worth if i'm totally honest with you i feel like it's just kind of rattled the cage of this person whoever this is um it may not be going in their favor but let's, so this is why again we've got the fall and the star because it's like what do they do they try and heal this now or do they ignore it and go full steam ahead trying to take the money and the legal side of it that's where the fall and the star come in we've got success so again it could be that they're going to have to try and heal this to resolve it possibly but there's definitely something here right let's see what else can you tell us here about the gemini reading what else can you say to us here spirit what is the other information that we need to be aware of please what else do we need to be aware of please what do you feel so again there could be a lot of confusion about what to do now so i think someone could be a bit like dissuaded or um, feeling a bit numb about the whole thing because again we've got big bold vision so someone had a really big plan but it's like they've been caught into this it hasn't quite gone the way they were expecting it to go which is i think put them on the on a bit of a back foot here it's almost kind of talked them out of so they made a really great bold move but now they're gonna to have to make another bold move towards either healing it or doing something that's gonna kind of improve the situation because it looks pretty dire if i'm totally honest with you and now we've got a victim so someone could be feeling like they're vic they're in a victim energy where they've tried to self-empower themselves they've run into that energy and now they're, they're thinking well why me it's not why me it's that that you may have over missed the first initial jumping in there may have been something overlooked which is why it wasn't quite ready 
that's how I'm feeling about it. Okay, we've got expansion. So again, this is about a perspective change to then look at the real issue, real perception, to then make a decision. You know, it doesn't have to always be about someone. Because I don't feel like this was... It feels like this is a lesson, if I'm honest. This is something that someone had to learn. Um, let's see, what else can you tell us about this? Integration, the frequency of integration supports our embrace of every aspect of ourselves, allowing what we perceive as positive and what we perceive as negative to harmonize in a balanced symphony of life. So this is perception. Someone's made a perception or, or understood something in a certain way and the reality hasn't quite matched. Someone's made a bold move and then it's kind of, maybe they think they're not in a strong position, but they actually are. That could be the other element to it. Right, let's see what else, please. Final message, please, for Gemini. What is the final message for Gemini's reading? They're just saying keep going. You need to keep going. Patience. Your dreams are blooming more rapidly than you realise. Still, they need nurturing and patience. And then bottom of the deck is career transition. Your life purpose is triggering a blessed career change. Okay, so let's take final card for Gemini's reading. And wrap this up. What is the final energy here for Gemini? What is the final uh, message for Gemini's reading for this particular area? Okay, it is important right now to take a step back, spend some time alone. Instead of placing your focus on another, now it is time to give to yourself. Okay, so there needs to be a bit of healing maybe for you as well, where you're giving the time, because there's a new cycle here that's being born, all right? So anyway, hopefully that's helped. Thank you for your likes, your shares, and your subscriptions. It means a lot to me. Until next time, guys, take care. Bye.